I had a little bit of a sort out yesterday and moved some pigeons around. So uh, in here we've got uh, four cocks and then one hen. That's the hen there. The hen and a cock are gonna be going uh, into the breeding section just to breed some birds for the winter for some one loft races. I've already moved two pairs across. Um, it's still undecided on what to do with these. So these are all aside for the winter one loft race. So we've got uh, any with the ETS rings on there, you see they are, they were raced and got a couple there that haven't even been out yet, a couple that have just been trained. So yeah, that's what I'm thinking of sending, but I've also got options to send some of these as well. So like, he raced quite well, and that checker white flight in the corner, that raced quite well. Um, so I'm thinking, do I send those instead? So I've got choices to make. There's a couple of odds and sods in here as well that will just go into the race team for next year. So that's what we've got there. And then the stock birds are still still paired and, and probably looking to go down on eggs again soon. I've just put two pairs in here, that one there and that one there, to try and get those to pair. Again, just to take some later pigeons off them to breed. It's a lovely day today, so I'm just going to let these cocks and the one hen out for a bit of fly and then they'll just let themselves back in. Come on then you lot. You're going to have a little fly. Should go straight out with a little bit of encouragement. Don't take too much looking after at the moment. Just as they're been split when the racing season's finished. got a few experiments to do just want to see how long these birds will fly for um, when they're not paired up nice watching them fly on a day like this I want a few more next year to watch a really nice big flock going so yeah I'll let you know what I do decide to do with the uh, with the one loft pigeons and keep you all posted